This is a how to on uh, changing the air filter on a Honda Elite 110, also known as the NXX 110. Only tool you need is a uh, Phillips screwdriver, number two. You also need a new Honda air filter. New Honda air filter. Alright, so first you need to take off the side cover right here. So there's two screws. One. Two. After that, you need to pop this little piece of plastic off right here. Okay. Now to move this cover off, you have to slide it forward and kind of push it down a little bit. Okay. So now we need to Remove the uh, this cover right here. And it's actually seven screws all together. That's one, two, three, four, five, six, and seven in here. So to take this out, <clears throat> you have to remove this cover, but along with that, you want to remove the uh, the filter housing right behind the cover with it. It all comes out easily. Okay. So here's the cover underneath. This is the air filter housing right here, and just here's the old air filter. And you can see how dirty that is uh, compared to the the new one right big difference in uh in cleanliness and uh so this old filter uh this right here i have 7000 miles on it honda recommends <coughs> uh changing the filter at 7500 miles and i do it i did it a little bit early just because uh remembering every 1000 miles is easier than remembering uh it at you know seven and a half thousand miles uh, intervals. So here you need to take off four screws.
the new one on <clears throat> make sure it has a proper orientation there you go so harness this is kind of neat it has this little uh, <clears throat> uh, backup uh, metal piece here with a little mesh here to sort of support the air filter so it doesn't um, So just in case the, the filter uh, doesn't just collapse for whatever reason. So this looks like a, uh, <clears throat> this is a paper type, it looks like it's been oiled, uh, oil paper type instead of a dry paper type. Remember, everything here is uh, that they're screwing on is, is plastic, so take it easy on on uh, uh, on uh, tightening it. Don't don't overdo it. Otherwise, you just strip the plastic pretty easily. Um, Honda has pretty good plastics. The plastic is pretty high quality, so it's a lot more durable than most other type of plastic, uh, or even compared to a lot of other bikes. Alright, so now it's in. So before I put it back on, I want to check my airbox. Make sure everything's clean in here. I'm looking in the airbox and it, I don't see any type of dust particles settling down anywhere. That means the uh, the filter had a pretty had had a good seal. I'm gonna check the back side on here too. Everything looks clean. So yeah, so once again, that says that it's it has a good seal. So to put this on, you don't want to put the filter in. Or the housing on, then the cover on, because if you look here, you see that this side, the inside of the filter, uh, the clean side, it has a much lower profile, whereas the the dirty side, it's uh, it sticks out more, it protrudes out more. So to put it in easily, we we'll actually want to pop this uh, filter housing onto the cover, All right? Put it onto the cover. Then you can slide it in easily. All right, make sure it fits it in there properly. And now you can put your screws back in. Usually, when you tighten things, um, it's best to work from the middle towards the outside so I'm just actually just placing my shoes there I'm not, I'm not tightening them down yet D 
again, uh, remember everything that you're screwing on is plastic, so take it easy on uh, tightening it. So now we want to tighten it down, so like I said, put from the middle, out. Okay, now let's put that cover over here back on. So here you have these little tabs. I'm going to make sure that it's in the slot. Alright, so when you slide it on, on the front here, front here there's also two tabs here uh, make sure that that goes into the slot as well okay so let's set everything in okay everything's on properly okay put my little uh, plastic piece down here on so now for the two final screws And that's it. Real easy uh, to change out the air filter. Um, again, here's the old one. See how dirty it is. That's only 7,000 miles. I ride uh, rain, shine, uh, pretty much any condition. Um, once again, I change it at 7,000 miles just because it's easy for me to remember uh, every thousand mile, uh, 7,000 mile intervals instead of uh, 7,500 miles interval uh, as Honda recommends the clean side. Alright, thank you for watching.